Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to today's video. We're checking out a very weird, honestly, looking house. This is called Beautiful Beach House in Vespucci Beach, made by Rock Dwayne the Johnson. If you can smell what the rock is making a map for... That was really lame. Anyway, though, look at this thing. It's it's weird. I don't know what to, how to describe it. It was really weird. For some reason, it kind of reminds me of something like out of SpongeBob. I really don't know why, but it reminds me of like a SpongeBob house. I don't know why. It doesn't even look like SpongeBob size. But when I saw this, I was like, that kind of reminds me of SpongeBob. Like, no idea why. It's very very strange. Uh, you know, it says it's a beautiful one. I'd say it's a it's a quite a strange one in in like a unique way. It's really different. It looks strange as fuck. Oh. God damn, gotta be careful with them swear words now with the new YouTube stuff. We're not allowed to blow this way, are we? No, 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 no. No can do. So here we got a garage area here with two cars in there, but there's nothing really to do with a garage here. You could add some kind of tools on the wall, some kind of like toolboxes or something, so that'd be a nice detail, but there's nothing really going on here, you know what I'm saying? So let's go inside this little pineapple thing here and check it. Do you see what I mean? Like, if, if this thing was a bit taller... Uh, kind of shaped like a pineapple. It look like SpongeBob's houses. I don't know why. It's just because it's on a beach, and I'm like, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a moron. Okay. Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. Oh. All right, we're in. So now you can see why I think it's kind of a bit of a weird house. Okay. It's literally almost like a little circle with no walls. <laughs> it's got a fucking huge egg clock. If that doesn't scream, whoever lives here is a weirdo. Then I don't know what that does. If if you have a huge egg lock like this like why would you okay i don't really know where to start i guess let's start with this side so we got a fridge just a fridge on its own is there a kitchen or anything like that it doesn't look like it. we just got a fridge we don't need anything else all right just fridge the guy eats like raw chicken all right he doesn't care he doesn't care does this man look like he cares he has an egg watch all right or a clock not a watch he has a huge egg clock this man does not care about not eating raw meat okay we've got tables here with a couple of red cups interesting and then we've got this who the fuck sits on that look at that that's weird like there's like a little tiny 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 table who 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 is so small to be able to sit in that what the hell like that's that's even smaller for that even midgets even midgets can't fit in that over here we've got the tv area very nice with a sofa uh, sofa looks a bit nasty Looks real old. I mean, there's something like growing out. What is that? Look, there's something like growing out of it. Like, what the fuck is that? It's like a really old couch. Like, the guy just found it outside and was like, yep, that's mine now. But then he's got, like, technology here, like a nice TV, like a nice laptop, but he can't afford a nice couch. Like, what the fuck? Over here, I guess he's got a wardrobe, but the only colors he knows is black by the looks of things. And he's got these scary ski masks. So, is he like a killer? Does a killer live here? You know what I'm saying? That's a little bit weird, a little bit scary, a little bit creepy. He's a big fan of his chocolates as well, by the looks of things. He loves them. Look at his candy. He loves his candy bars. Then, you know, crazy pool game as well. These windows are way too small. You can't even see anything from them. Look how low these are. Like this one. Yeah. Okay, cool. You can kind of see it. You need to, it kind of needs to be in the middle. But then these ones are like at the bottom. Like you can't see anything. Like you have to like freaking break your neck to see anything outside. So this house is extremely fucking weird if you ask me really weird and he's got his bed over here uh he's got another clock on the bed like this guy's a bit strange i mean look at that really i hate them clocks because they make a noise i hate the clocks that make a ticking noise i just want to strangle them i'm gonna kill the person that has clocks like that i don't really but you know what i'm saying when you try and sleep and it's like like why what the fuck do you need that for why don't i just start banging with a hammer on the table it'll make the same fucking shitty noise he's got a little jukebox pretty goddamn cool you know when he wants to listen to some tunes and then and again he has a tiny little table like look at that you're gonna get like a hunchback you have to like this doesn't make sense like this should be higher this table's way too small for his little work area like look at that how the fuck what the hell the, the, the chair is higher than the table it just looks extremely uncomfortable and then there's something outside here as well so let's check this area out and we have a little back garden with a with just like a little tiny fire pit there like it's not even a fire pit it's just a little bit of wood burning there very fancy uh got a little beach ball but it's kind of like stuck in the sand so very interesting house really weird uh very strange i'm gonna say this is an extremely strange beach house you know i'm not gonna say it's a it's a beautiful beach house no it's a strange beach house in Spooji beach for sure all right so i changed it to nighttime just so we can see some of the pretty lights on the house there is some cool lights that do like that which is kind of neat inside as well it's all pretty lights here you can kind of see which is nice touch uh the lights do make it a little bit better but still uh it's gotten strange because it's just like a weird circle with weird windows and i don't know i'm not the biggest fan of this i like it because it's so fucking weird 
Do you know what I mean? I've seen some really good house mods, and it's always nice to see some really not so good ones. I want to say this is the worst house I've ever seen, because there is one that I covered that is absolutely terrible that we'll upload at a later date. But this one uh, is extremely fucking strange. Wow, this gate works as well, but it's like really weird. What is that? Look, what's, what is going on? What the fuck is going on there? Look at this. Are you kidding me? What has happened here? What the WTF? I am so confused with what? All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna end the video there. That's that's weird. That, that, that's honestly, this is a weird little weird little house. That's the best way I can describe it. Very weird. Leave a like. Leave a dislike if you enjoyed it. Leave a dislike if you didn't enjoy it. Uh, thanks for watching. And before we go, let's get rid of this bad boy and see what bloody disappears. I guess. Still can't get over these really tiny windows. I mean, you can't even see anything from me. You have to be absolute little midget to see anything. Like, what the hell? The windows definitely need to be higher. <laughs> like, it's so weird. And then these windows here, you kind of got bigger windows so you can see stuff. But then after that, all the windows are tiny. So it's like really inconsistent. Like, what the hell? Who made this house? Who designed this house? Oh, God. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All right, so let's get rid of it. One, two, three, and KP. There she bloody goes. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Subscribe for more, and thanks for watching. Bye.